the Gemara basically is basically Mishnayis and Rices, which are very similar to Mishnayis, pasted together with function words. I was always bothered by the Mishnah in Perkei Abus that starts off Ben Chamesh the Mikvah, Ben Eser the Mishnah, Ben Chamesh Yisrael the Gemara. It didn't make sense to me to open up the Gemara and learn Gemara and not having learned that much Tanakh and not learning that much Mishnayis. It's like living in the third floor of the apartment, but you didn't build the first and second floor. I was very bothered by that. I didn't want to do anything radical and abandon the system. Um, but what I did do was on the side, I took like a half hour a day. I spent like a, I did a, like five psukim a day, and I did two Mishnayis a day. And sometimes I did a little more, sometimes I spent a little more time on it. When I started going to Mishnayis, so I learned, appreciated that. When you know the Mishnayis independently, what would used to stop me, get me stuck for two weeks, it would take two minutes now because, oh, I know the Mishnah, and now I can see what the Gemara is doing with it. So the stronger your ability is to learn and understand a Mishnah clearly, a Brisa clearly, to understand the language, get familiar with the, the pattern. Uh, Mishnahis have a certain rhythm to them. The more we focus on that and get competency and a fluency and an expertise and that, then the rest of the Gemara becomes a lot easier.